Today we're paddleboarding Casa Cenote. It's between Acamal and Tulum, south of Cancun. And this is a trip you're going to want to book a tour guide for because you can't get there by yourself. It's also a trip that's equally paddleboarding and snorkeling. I would bet that the paddleboarding part of this trip is maybe 200 yards at the most. And then you're going to get out and go snorkeling. But here's the catch. On this cenote lives a crocodile. And he's been known to swim with people. I don't know if he's been known to eat people, but he is there and you need to be aware of him. That's why you need a guide. On our trip down Casa Cenote, we did not see the crocodile sitting there. We thought he was in the water, but our guide assured us that he was eating in the bushes and would, we would be fine. That's when it was time to get in the water and go snorkeling. I'll admit, it was a little scary getting in the water. We were terrified. And then we were sure happy we did. The water was beautiful. We saw lots of fish. And you betcha, we did keep our eye out for that crocodile. We saw scuba divers. We saw schools of fish. We loved swimming through the mangrove roots. But we never saw that crocodile, thank goodness. And we love using our Pro Shot case. It fits right over our iPhone and it works just like a GoPro. Here's our ratings for the Casa Cenote. It got a little lower rating for location and parking just because it's hard to find. The cost is pretty high, but the adventure, that crocodile makes it all worth it. We gave it a final rating of a 7.66. Don't forget, be sure to like and subscribe. And until next time, keep paddling.